fram nu vid första kontrollen. Kolla om pass och sånt här. different place for exclusion zone they are uh, very different so one side uh, should be more so another side should be less so well all, all these techniques they were very close to the uh, reactive number four and was uh, in need here a long period of time why they were chosen all this military equipment so levels of radiation mm. Mm. Oh, well, that's why I think you understand why, it's, uh, why it was you was informed to have so uh, uh, close part of skin as possible, because uh, just to escape some dust contamination of there. That's why all such recommendations, no shots and so on. That's why we should be careful with the places where a lot of dust at all. The same well, contaminated place where it was engine, where it was regular air filtration, because you know when engine works, it's uh, pumped, uh, pumped in a lot of dust. Well, and now we are pretty close to the Chernobyl nuclear power plant, so uh, just uh, several kilometers. And uh, uh, now we are on site where a big village was before the accident. Well, the name of village was Kopachi. Translated into English, it sounds uh, diggers. Well, what happened with this village? It was uh, evacuated on the 3rd of May of 1986, just in a week after the accident. And later, uh, well, um, it was a dare to bury all villages, uh, to dig in uh, all villages of the exclusion zone. And this one, this is was the first if I uh, have a look to the right side and uh, everywhere there we could notice small hills with a sign of radioactivity on the top. There are uh, places where houses were before the accident. So in 1991, well, um, Chernobyl nuclear power plant was operated again, well, normally. Uh, this road was constructed in those times like regular connection between uh, 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 Slobodich town and um, Chernobyl nuclear power plant. 80% of the stuff uh, was renovated on the nuclear power plant. And uh, even the slogan of the nuclear engineering uh, was changed. Well, in the Soviet time, do you remember what was the slogan of the Soviet uh, uh, nuclear engineering? Somebody knows? Well, accident on the nuclear power plants in Chernobyl, or sorry, in Soviet Union, uh, are impossible. Well, after this accident was a little bit modified. Impossible again. Well, but uh, nevertheless, uh, this village, because uh, it was on the regular road between um, uh, Slavutich and nuclear power plant, reminded to people of, with the empty windows of that about the real price for this energy. That's why it was, well, I think it was very political uh, to destroy all these houses and to bury on site here. So in 1991 this village was buried. Um, on such a way should be buried uh, other villages of the exclusion zone too. 
But in time, fortunately, in time it became very clear this activity is more harmful than useful because uh, um, uh, digging in the ground, uh, uh, all this radioactive waste were placed close to the underground waters. So it was very time taking, money taking, dose taking for the people and completely unnecessary for all of that. That's why such activity was completely refused and other villages were not buried at all. But uh, several around the nuclear power plant uh, were buried on such way. Uh, but some buildings, uh, remains of the village were not destroyed, like cattle farm, for example, to the left side. It was left uh, with the purpose to use in the future, it like maybe disposal for something or storage. So now we are pretty close to the industrial sites of the Chernobyl nuclear power plant and now we are on the, in the sector of the third stage of Chernobyl nuclear power plant. So 1986, four reactor units in operation and two new reactor units in the process of construction. Um, first and second stage had a big cooling system with cooling pond. Uh, for third stage, number five and six, they were constructed uh, um, cooling towers. There to the right side, you can see non-finished cooling towers for reactor units number five and six. And next building uh, now to the left, to the tower cranes around, uh, this is configuration of reactor unit uh, number five. Well, it was finished, now we'll come closer, I'll tell about it later. But now we are going to see a big uh, cooling pond, uh, artificial lake, which was constructed in the 70s, especially for Chernobyl nuclear power plant. Well, all heat plants, and especially nuclear power plants, they need a lot of water. Because water, this is the source of energy, first of all. Well, that's why for such pro projects, they were uh, uh, forecasted for a big uh, lake. If it uh, don't, didn't exist, existed they were constructed the same way was constructed cooling pond for chernobyl nuclear power plant well and um, sure this water should be uh, must be clean and what is the best methods to keep water clean it was necessary to cultivate and uh, to uh, a lot of fish which uh, eats all this vegetation in the water and as a result of that uh, water is clean and especially for this cooling pond even more cultivated special species of the wild or species of the fish which are able to eat a lot of vegetation and now we're going to see one of uh, the uh, fish farm uh, which was in, in use especially for chernobyl nuclear power plant uh, till, till the, those time when nuclear power plant was operated sure uh, this uh, and a fish farm walked to. Ну только что какой-то. Стой, 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 стой. Это мелкая тоже шуганула. Куда? Да, кусты. Малого кабанчика типа. Не видишь ничего? Он все будет. Если он уже ну вот он уже. Он уже он уже да, он уже на другой стороне. Двенцин. Well, and there, uh, after the accident, to show that it was, uh, it had two functions. One of that, it was a fish farm, and another one, the laboratory to study what process going on with this fish when they live in so highly contaminated place. So now that to the right side, we can see this cooling pond, showing the sediments, well, a lot of <coughs> contamination. Also can go outside. Den larmat är över 0,3 då. Då man stänger av larmet här då. Ja. 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 Ja.